What's good, gentlemen? Week four of the franchise, all the boys. 3,000 watching right now. All the boys, thank you for being here with me. It's going to be a big week. We got a doubleheader today, but first things first, let's worry about the games that we have at hand. This week, the Lions are taking on the New England Patriots. All right, so one thing I want to point out, you look at the Patriots record, they're 0-3. You're saying, Matt, this is a cakewalk of a game. The Patriots lost to the Super Bowl champion Jets by one touchdown. I lost to the Jets by seven. Okay, the Jets shit on me. So I think the Patriots have had a super difficult schedule. I know he's very good. I cannot look at this 0-3 record and think this game's gonna be a cakewalk. That's all. That's, I guess, all I have to say. Like, it, whether he said 3-0 or 0-3, I wouldn't care. So that's how we feel right now. He has a very good team. We did not get to play the Patriots last season. The Patriots is managed by a new owner. It's one of our best VIPs. I hate to take favorites, but Zach, you're awesome. Zach has helped us out a ton on this channel. So we got the man in the next-gen Xbox, and he's in the franchise now. Excited to have him and uh, excited to play him today. This should be fun. Here's his squad. Tristan Wirfs is all the way up to a 96, which is actually insane that you could get Tristan Wirfs that high. He's got Brandon Cooks, a lot of speed, but he probably regressed a little bit this year since he's older. So 93 speed. I'm not too worried about that. I think Bryce Callahan can keep up. Kyler Murray, I'm scared about. 92 speed, most likely as a skate artist. He's a superstar X Factor. That's kind of fucking scary. Damian Harris, I'm not too worried about. He is a good running back. I know the Patriots, uh, Zach, I know Zach runs the ball a lot and he has a good offensive line. So I'll be aware of it. Calvin Ridley, slightly scared about. It. I mean, if he beats me, if Zach really wants to take that gamble and beat me over the top, if he really wants to risk it all and go big on a big gamble with Calvin Ridley and take me over the top, then, you know, it's just going to happen. So I'll have Callahan and Jesse Bates ready. Odafe Owe, such a sick player. I wish I got him. 90 speed beast. Put him at left end. Linder, John Johnson. Ah, uh, Rashawn Evans is a good user. The rest of his team, I'm not too worried about. So his corners. He's got Sean Murphy bunting, CJ Henderson, Jeff Okuda. He has a very smart CFM team. Like, these are high speed, not too high overall corners, which is really all you need in franchise. But low key, I still think both DK and Jameson Williams can torch them. DK has 96 or 97 speed and Jameson has 96. So I actually think I can take him over the top. He also has Quez Watkins, who has 98 speed. When, since when the fuck did Quez Watkins have 98 speed? This is just one of the smartest franchise teams I've seen. That is how you draft your franchise right there. Let's do weekly strategy first. See, why does it, why has it been doing this? It shows their backup quarterback as the person that it's like scouting it makes no fucking sense either way i'm actually gonna i'm not worried about defending the pass i am worried about the run i'm gonna just defend outside run i'll see what happens i guess and then offensively yeah big shocker here i'm throwing it deep my weekly game plan goal will be to throw two plus touchdown passes let's start on this let's go less than four yards per carry i want to bottle up damian harris i want to pass for 275 plus and i want to win the turnover battle i love all of those we're still doing james Jameson, Daxton, Mac Jones, Trey Smith, DeAndre Swift, and Andrew Thomas. Everything's ready to go. Training's complete. We know the Patriots roster. All right, boys. Uh, playing Zach. He's 0-3, but I know he's good. He's trying to have a good game here. Oh, I put Jamison Williams in my kick returner as well. Because I want him to get extra touchdowns here. And he's so fast, I figure he probably has a good shot. Although it's dumb when he gets hit stuck like that. Because now he's gassed for the first play of the game. All right. We'll just go inside zone DeAndre Swift. Damn, that man got back there so fast. All right, we're going to keep this. We're going to keep high uh, high tempo. Let's see what we got here. Ooh, Metcalf wide open. Beautiful throw. 19 yards for Mac Jones. We don't got to think too hard about it. All right, so I know Jamison Williams is a little fatigued from getting hit stuck like that. That's the only reason I'm not going to him right now. Let me look at fatigue. Oh, no, he's good. He's at almost 100%. Damn, okay. First and 10, stick to the run game. Juke inside of Rashawn Evans. DeAndre Swift, I am so glad I traded Pollard. Better offensive line, slightly worse technically overall running back, but Swift is a fucking beast, bro. All right, we're going to be smart about this play call. I've got some time to throw a relatively deep one. Ooh. Johnny, drop that? Really? Okay, so I think this is the this is the stretch where I have that insane pass audible. Yeah, PA cross. That audible is nuts. Third and two. Still gonna run it because I want the first town. And just in case Zach is stream sniping, I wanted him to hear me say that I was switching to a pass, and I actually think it worked. Zach, you better not be stream sniping, my guy. Oh wait, that's not the audible I want, is it? It's this. Yeah, this play is nasty, bro. This play is nasty. I don't even know who that is. I thought that was going to be James Mitchell. But it ended up being some actual bum. But whatever, it's yards. And we'll just go right back to DeAndre Swift here. I think this is actually free. Ah! 
not free. Free was not the word to describe that. Our tempo is killing him right now, though. He's not able to adjust quick enough. And I'm fairly certain. Oh, I have red zone threat on DK. Is he single? He's not single coverage. Oh, shit. Damn it. Lost yards. Do I have the patience to run the ball? Fuck no, I don't have the patience to run the ball. Third and 11. Ooh, I think that's there. Yes, sir. DeAndre Swift. Can he get there? Breaks a tackle. Down to the four. Four for five. 57 yards. And just as I said, I don't have the patience for it. I'm going to have the patience for it. Let's go. Cut inside DeAndre. DeAndre Swift. With a nasty cut. Let's go for two. Beauty. Oh, shit. Oh, that fucking glitch-ass blitz. That's so dumb. All right. That's fine. That's okay. I don't think he did that on purpose. I think it was just sometimes, sometimes no one gets blocked. Dude, that guy actually, that linebacker came off the edge completely. Six to zero. I will say, last season I was much better about my two point conversions. I've been pretty poverty this season, but I'm still gonna go for him every time. Oh shoot, I have to make that adjustment, don't I? It won't put in Foyasad. I hate that it does that. Damian Harris for two yards. Like, why does it do this? I have the adjustment made in my formation subs, and it always comes out of it. Second and eight. I expect a lot of run plays, probably up the middle. He's calling an audible on this one. Oh, a pass. Okay. Okay. Left side, tight end, wide open. Nick Boyle? Who is that? This is a good example, though. They just don't need tight ends, dude. You could use anybody at tight end, and they're going to play well. This is probably a run, especially, like, with that successful pass play. Aluakon through the middle. Oh, get there. <laughs> we were on Kyler's head, but we weren't able to get it. He doesn't have Hot Route Master, does he? How many audibles did he make there? Holy shit. Holy shit, he has Gunslinger, Hot Route Master, Escape. What the fuck? Since when does Kyler get all that? Holy shit, are you kidding? That's insane. I should be able to make that tackle. Daxon Hill get tackled. Dude, Kyler has so much. That's gross. But probably run the ball again. Yeah, just how successful that was. Ooh, we're there this time, baby. Yes, sir. Jordan Whitehead. Dude, I did not realize how broken Kyler is. What? Second and 10. Let's see what he's got. Is this a slip screen? I'm on Leonard Williams. I'm on Leonard Williams. And I almost lurked him with Leonard Williams. Bad throw from Kyler right there. Third and 10. Not sure what he wants here. About to find out. Nah, I'm scared against Hot Route Master to be running a man. But, okay, fine. I'll go for the two. Ooh, this works. Ooh, Damon Harris is a beast, but it's fourth and four. It's gonna be a big pickup. Fourth and three. He's gotta get cheeky here. This is gonna be a tough one. This could determine the game right here. All right, I have a really interesting set here. See if he goes with fourth and three. Lots of audibles. He wants to throw low. He just wants to pick it up quick because this is so stressful. Yes, sir! One, two, three! With the QB spy! Let's go! Massive play. Oh, that's big. All right, first and 10. Metcalf. Metcalf! Oh, he hung on to it. I thought it was a touchdown. DK Metcalf has literally saved me so many fucking games. It's not even funny. It's disgusting, actually. All right, hang out. Let's hang out. Let's hang out in this pocket. Let's hang out. All right, that's fine. Don't fumble. There's two yards. It's all good. All right, second and 12. Let's be smart. He's playing back. I could get some serious run yards here. Ooh, good. Okay. Okay, none of those plays were particularly impressive. I'm gonna need to break out the playbook and come up with something fancy here if I'm gonna wanna pick this up. I would like a corner route. I don't know if I have any formation that drive wide corner. Is Janu gonna be open here? Could get a James Mitchell touchdown. I don't know how I feel about this, but only one way to find out. Oh, I'm fucking sending that shit. I had him. Oh, I got to be smart and take my field goal. I had him. He caught it. I'm out of bounds. I had to throw that earlier. Let Janu just beak. Oh, no. I think I shanked that. I did. Just going for it now. Kind of forgot how hard it is to kick a franchise. All right, let's just get another stop then. That was an L plus a ratio, if I've ever seen one. Let's see what he goes with. First and 10. Uh, he might break that tackle. Goes out of bounds after six yards. I think there's a different culture there. I think they'll squeak out some, some games that he probably shouldn't win. Ooh, in his face, pressured Kyler Murray. Third and four. This might be a run play, low key. Kind of expect a run play here. That or a throw underneath to a halfback. What did I say, bro? Oh, no way. 
Wait. <laughs> Kyler's fucking broken, bro. What was that? Wow. That was quite the play right there. I expect a run play. What do I always say in Wheel Em Up, bro? If you get some horse shit to happen for you, you always run the ball. That's what people do. Need a big one. Need a big hit. Ooh, damn. Dude, these like regular sized tight ends just are so good. They just be sitting in the pocket. Can't let him throw underneath. Aluakon! Flattened him. Huge play right there. Second and 12. I'm not sure. Let's see what he thinks up on this one. All right, I'm on Whitehead. I got protection elsewhere. Let's see what he wants. Super sketchy. Super sketchy. Oh, damn. That would have been a big one. Third and 12. That's okay. We have gotten a stop before. We know we can stop him again. That was almost right in the midst of somebody, bro. Third and 12. Let's see what he wants. Motion and boil out. Goes right in the middle. Nice catch, Damian Harris. Clock's ticking. First and 10. Maybe something similar. Maybe just a run play. Zach, I can't tell if you're griefing or you just actually take 40 seconds to call every play. All right, we need to stop here, boys. This is big. We need to stop here. Second and eight. See if we can get the red zone stop. He's got to wait and see what defense I'm in. What the fuck is this? What are you taking eight years for every play call? Third and one. Fakes the snap. Okay, he calls a timeout here. First and goal. I'm just sitting here with my thumb in my ass. What are you Googling what play to pick? Do you not know what play you already want? I can't tell if you're fucking kidding. You called a timeout. The clock can't chew. Okay, so he could still run the ball. If he runs the ball is what I'm worried about right now. Everything else I'm not worried about. Speak of the devil. But we're there to clamp it. I think he's going to roll out right. I'm going to float that way with a little gun. <sighs> nice play. Pats get a touchdown. They get ball half two. So this is going to be a little sketchy. But I do have 19 seconds, two timeouts. I think if I'm efficient, I could probably get another field goal up. Uh, what should I have done there? Oh, that throw away was way too deep, bro. I don't got that kind of clock. Where's Jamison in my Okay, he's in a spot to make a play. I think I'm just going to stat pad here. Yeah. <coughs> wait, wait, I didn't mean to dive after I caught that. All right, decent stat padding. Got some yards there for Metcalf. Seven to six, maybe the most boring game I've ever played in franchise. Going good, throwing it deep. That field goal is hurting me right now. I can't believe I missed a field goal. As for defending, he's not running anything in particular that I'm too worried about. I'm about to see like 40 run plays, aren't I? Speak of the devil. I'm sorry that you guys have to watch this. I can't even commentate. This is so boring. Oof, would have been a nice pick. We're almost there with Bud Dupree getting in his face. It's making it hard for him to make that throw. All right, so now we got the run play. It's not a run play. That's pretty good news. And that's a pretty big hit. We keep hitting him like that. Maybe we get a fumble. You're running the same three plays. There's no way you have these audibles to make. What audibles are these? I'd rather be losing by 21 than sit through this. fuck are we doing zach bro what are we doing that's no huddle maybe he got the memo play action Ooh, who is this shifty man all right we're starting to see a little bit of football here how's he owing three has he put three people through this bro second and five he's gonna throw half back oh right here you're just under it Oh, we rocked him, but it's a touchdown. So a PAT puts him up by eight. All right, so I got to score. I got to get the two points. All right, Swift is open. Beautiful. Get inside of Okuda. Hey, a lion on lion right there. How many yards did I have to pass for for my game plan? 300 plus and beat the Patriots? Beating the Patriots looking tough, but 300 plus isn't looking too bad. Man coverage. Beautiful. We love man coverage. Ooh, nice tackle. All right, I'm trying to pick up the pace of this game a little bit. I'm literally just running plays so that we can fucking move along here. Still doesn't pick up DeAndre Swift. Would you pick him up? Here we go, baby. We're moving the ball. Where'd you hear that? Okay, he's got someone on him now. But that means he's in cover two, which means I could dot him up a little bit here. Oh, cover three cloud. Okay, so he's got one low over there. 
there he is. Damn, why are they struggling so bad with the under Swift? Guy is just getting yard after yard after yard. We just not pull the trigger, gentlemen, or what? Ow. All right, if I do that again, he's going. Is this a delayed blitz? Hey, Jamison Williams! Tutty! Now we're playing some football, finally! Thank God, I was about to kill myself. Oh my God, let's go! Jamison Williams, damn, I'd really like that uh, field goal right now, but we're finally playing some football, baby. Let's go. All right, two-point conversion. Not sure what I bought, but we're gonna take D Swift to the edge here. See if he's got the sauce. Cuts inside! Tie that ball game up! Let's go! 14 to 14. Four minutes, 28 seconds left. We gotta sit through another brutal fucking round of Patriots offense. Okay. Honest to God, I do not care if I win the game. I just hope that this is not a four minute drive for a field goal or just some shit. Like, just play the fucking game. Please, Zach. All right, let's see what happens. Dude, Swift has been amazing. I love DeAndre Swift, bro. He's been amazing. I have to give him the fucking ball back and sit through this shit again. Oh, you saw the Luacon back there. 11 rushes, 36 yards. That should tell you it all right there. Averaging three and a half yards per carry. Keeps doing it. We've seen this before. Let's get a QB spy on him. I'm on full your side. Second and nine. Okay, not too bad. Not 3,000 audibles. Could have been worse. Wide open Boyle. Hey, there's a laser, baby. Listen, they can still play football. We know Kyler Murray can still play ball here. Could very well be a run. Let's see what he's got. Gotta get some pressure on him. Gotta make Kyler Murray make a mistake. Hot Rod Masters killing me right now. Mistake! Uh, I mean, it was a mistake. That very well could have been picked off. It wasn't. Second and 10. Haywire pass from Murray goes nowhere. Let's see what we got. It's a good game here, Chase. 14 to 14. It's a little slow, but uh, it's a good game. Yes. Oh! Oh, I wanted to rock him. Thought he caught that for a minute. It kind of looked like he did, didn't it? Kind of looked like he caught it. Is a run play, Damian Harris. Swooped up by Foe. You said, well, I'm definitely getting my less than four yards per carry challenge. No question about that. Second and nine. I think it's pretty clear this one's a pass. Let's see if we can bottle it up. I went through 18 audibles first. Good. Okay. The audibles have ended. <sighs> Callahan! Are you fucking me? That's the game right there. Drop three picks already. Damn. All right. Well, that was tough. That would have been nice. Just to get us back on offense, really, that would have been nice. As far as the game's concerned, I don't think I really give a shit. Callahan. Callahan makes up for it on the ensuing play. Bryce Callahan. Fucking MVP, bro. MVP this guy. Oh my God. Let's go. What a play. All right. Now let's just go down and score. I'm not running no chew clock fucking 80 audible nonsense. Let's go play the game. Let's go. That was my third audible. I hit my limit right there. D Swift to the edge. Yes, sir. Get inside. Oh, he switched off. All right. Only thing I'm going to do is I am going to motion Jameson. Because when I motion Jameson, it gets really tough for him to guard this. All right. Sorry. I'm an audible fucking sweaty loser. But yeah, I mean, once we do that, it makes DeAndre Swift. DeAndre Swift's amazing. DeAndre Swift is so amazing. Let's go score, gentlemen. Let's go score. All right, first and 10. He's playing back. Okay, that's perfect. Excellent. Excellent stretch, DeAndre Swift. Eight rushes, 38 yards, a touchdown. Play action cross. We love this play. Just got the play. Just need the play action hold up. Great. It does. It does. Step up. Sketchy. Okay. Nice and sketchy. No question about that. Holy shit, that play was fucking had me fucking rattled. Ooh, I'm gonna get cheeky. On third and five, we're going with the DeAndre Swift. DeAndre Swift on third and five! Picks it up! What an animal! God, I love DeAndre Swift, bro. All right, DeAndre Swift. Ooh, missed a cheeky little pass there with Big Mac Jones. No lie, kind of an L. All right. Okay, he sent a delayed blitz off that side. Jono! Come on! Bring me the cavalry! 242, one touchdown, 15 for 20, Wanu Smith. That's why we didn't trade him, baby. Ooh, lots of blockers setting up. DeAndre Swift butt fucking naked wide open. Stop and go, stop and go. DeAndre Swift into the end zone! All right, this is kind of stupid because it puts me in jeopardy of losing the game. 
it puts me in jeopardy losing this game. But it was fire. That was on his own Lions teammate, bro. Now, we know we know the Patriots offense. I don't think he has any deep plays in his bag. I mean, maybe, but from what we've seen so far, I'm not very concerned about this. I do want to go cover four and send heat, though. I'd be shocked if he has a good play here. Aluakon through the middle. Get to him. Callahan! One more, baby! Why not? Oh, nice you guy. Ah! All right, 14 seconds. Do we go for a Jamison touchdown? I put myself in jeopardy losing the game here. Wanu. Stupid open. Get in there. Wanu! Why would I have ever traded him? Why would I have ever traded Wanu? We took that game from the most boring franchise game yet to a pretty sick one. I think so. Dude, this is... I, I hate to be such a little bitch, but this is really boring. And I want it to be good. And now I feel like it's a lot more exciting. All right. Um, probably can do the same thing. All right. Got to play over the top. Got to be ready. Got to be ready. Shit. We're not getting any pressure. It's no bueno. Ooh. Nice play, Jesse Bates. Covered a lot of ground. Two seconds on the clock. You know what, dude? If Callahan gets one more INT, I would be so pumped. Or even Daxton Hill. Oh, shit. I'm on the wrong dude. I'm on pain. Oh, is he going to go for the hook and ladder? Oh, my God. Didn't that look like a designed hook and ladder? It kind of did. The game ends. I got to go give a GG's to Zach. Holy shit. What a game, though. What a game. 28 to 14. Really looked like we were in jeopardy of losing that game. And we and we came out in the end and saw stuff. Wow. 158.1 from Mac Jones. 17 for 22. 283. Three touchdown passes. I think I needed to throw 275 plus. So that's really good. 15 for 25. 202. Two touchdowns. Two interceptions. It was a good game. I mean, these interceptions are inflated because of that last play there at the end. But Bryce Callahan stepped up big 12 rushes 37 yards damon harris he was pretty good but people were telling me damon harris was cracked and he was not cracked by any means i think DeAndre swift had an amazing game nine attempts 45 yards a touchdown he also had nine for 111 damon harris at 60 65 nick boyle bro who is this man nick boyle went so hard that game i think what zach needs zach needs a good tight end all right so i did not get oh the scenario was 300 passing yards i had 283 that is actually a bummer so I was just barely short. It would have been 10 franchise points. But I won the turnover battle. I passed for 275 plus. I allowed less than four yards per carry. And I threw two plus touchdown passes. So I get 13. Thomas gets an upgrade. Make him power once again. Why not? I know he's like a pretty damn good run blocking. Pass block power went up. Pass block power 87. Run block power 84. He's slightly better pass blocking. All right, gentlemen, big dub, three and one. We play the Packers next week. We know that's going to be a damn good game. So let's have some fun. See you boys soon. Peace.